So here in PowerPoint, I have a slide that's all messed up and I have my alignment tool all set up and ready to go. So here's what it looks like. I can just select my objects, Alt 1T for top. I can select these, bring them to the bottom. I can send this one to the left. I can bring it to the center. I can bring this one to the right, bring it to the center. I can even select everything, regroup it, set it to align the slide and I'm done. And that's not only fast, saving you a ton of time, it also ensures your slides look sharp, clean and professional. That's why the alignment tool is the best PowerPoint shortcut ever once you set it up. And this is just one of a handful of simple PowerPoint techniques I've pulled together into a short little speed training series that you can join today for free that will save you 40 hours this year in PowerPoint as soon as you start using them. Because if you're like most people, you're learning PowerPoint on the fly, right? Maybe you've read a book or two, or maybe you've combed the web for tips and tricks, but when it comes to putting it together and getting shit done, you're left to your own devices to figure it out. Which is why even after spending years in the program, you're always thinking in the back of your head, there has to be a better way. Well, now with over one and a half million views on YouTube and having worked with thousands of professionals online, I've gone ahead and pulled together the best time-saving tips and tricks to help you avoid the number one rookie mistake I see people even with years of PowerPoint experience still making in the program. And that is spending a bunch of time manually performing tasks that, with a little bit of strategy and technique, PowerPoint will automatically do for you 10 times faster and 10 times more perfectly. That's why it's just never a good use of your time, period, exclamation point, angry face. Anyway, to join the free speed training series while it's still available and start saving 40 hours today in PowerPoint, just follow the link below. You'll also learn how to turbocharge the number one activity in bold italics that's eating you up alive in the program right now. Up to 40% of your build time is probably spent here on a daily basis. And just imagine what your slide life will look like once you've eliminated 40% of the unnecessary stuff you're currently spending time on just clicking around within the program. That's why I'm not joking when I say once you have these speed training strategies and techniques down, you can't help but save 40 hours this year in PowerPoint, at least. To see for yourself how much time you can start saving in PowerPoint today, click the button below and sign up for free while the course is still available. With these strategies and techniques down, you'll never be able to use PowerPoint the old way again. I guarantee it.